The Google TV platform, just like Amazon Fire TV, is constantly trying to battle sideloading and really just control which applications you install on your device. Some time ago, they introduced a new feature called Play Protect. And this feature would now scan any application you try to install on your device. And if it didn't recognize a developer, it would block you installing the application. Now, of course, you can just click on install anyway, but whilst Play Protect was running on your device, it would constantly scan any application and any application it didn't like, it would automatically uninstall that for you. So my personal recommendation was always, if you are somebody that enjoys third party applications, just go ahead and turn that feature off. But Google are now taking this to the next level and allowing developers to completely block sideloading of their application on any Android TV or any Google TV device. So this article was posted a few days ago on 95 Google, so very trustworthy resource. And it's saying Android apps can now effectively force Google Play download, effectively blocking sideloading. Now, what this actually means is developers can now modify their code to say that if this application wasn't installed from the Google Play Store, do not allow this application to run. The article says an updated API available to Android developers can now force users to download applications from Google Play only, blocking that from working if it was sideloaded. So that API will do that check for you. And if it detects that you're trying to install this application from a website or from a third party application store, it will basically block you trying to install it. This was first announced in the Google IO and it says Play Integrity API gives developers new tools to improve the safety and security of Android applications. And they're basically using the angle of safety and security saying applications are only safe if they are downloaded from the Google Play Store. But but as millions of people know that do regularly sideload applications, they know that's not a true statement because you can get completely safe applications from other websites, from open source application stores, really from many other places. And they're saying that this new feature of Play Integrity is to check whether an app is licensed, referring to if it was installed from the Google Play Store or not. That's basically how it's going to do the check. And the user experience will be, if it comes back as unlicensed, they'll have the option to install it from the Play Store, and then the version which was sideloaded will be automatically uninstalled from their device. And you can see some applications like Tesco, like Beyblade X, like ChatGPT, all of these now are running with this feature, which means when you try to run them, it will tell you that to continue using this application, you have to get it on Google Play. So it doesn't matter if you sideloaded it from anywhere else, because of this new switch, it will force you to get this application directly from the Play Store. And when you install it from there, and it will then remove the application that you previously sideloaded. So you can see the direction where these big companies like Amazon, like Microsoft, like Google are going. They really want to have that complete control of exactly which applications you install onto your device. Doesn't matter if it's your device that you paid for it. They still want to have that control of exactly what you install on it. Now, in terms of cord cutters, people in the streaming community, how this exactly impacts you. For now, because your applications, the ones that you sideload, because those applications are not available in the Play Store anyway. So you really can't see any logic of those developers enabling this new switch. But overall, guys, it definitely does look like things are going to get more stricter. Things are going to get more locked down. And again, with this ultimate aim from these big corporations, they really just want to keep an eye and monitor and track and log as much as they can what you do on your personal streaming devices. And of course, one of the best things you can do to protect your privacy is to use some kind of VPN because with the VPN enabled, it means that your traffic is encrypted. It means your ISP can't monitor you. All of these advertisers, all of these tracking companies, they can't see what you're doing. And it just means you have a more secure, more private experience on your streaming device. Right now, there's a super special offer just for the next two weeks where you can get total protection for unlimited devices. Doesn't matter if you have 10 Fire Sticks or 25 Android TVs and four laptops, all of your devices will be covered with a single license. You can then change your IP address, change your virtual location. You can hide your online activities. You can access all of your favorite streaming applications wherever you are in the world, really to get all of that for just $2.19 a month. I really think this special offer is definitely worthwhile checking out. And they also give you those three months free. Using my link does help support my channel. So many thanks if you want to do that. 
do have a look in the video description and pinned comment if you want to take up this special offer do leave me a comment below let me know what you think and i'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon thanks